What's up folks and welcome to a first look at Contraband Police. So this is a game that I've been wanting to play for a while. This game was released back in 2021 and I've seen a couple uh, videos on TikTok. I've seen a couple of YouTubers broadcast this game, but I haven't really gone into too much detail on every aspect of the game. So clearly this game, we are going to search vehicles. We're going to check IDs. We are the border patrol essentially, which 100% is, is, is what we are. This game calls us a border guard inspector, which we are because we will inspect vehicles, we'll inspect your ID. We'll make sure you're not trying to bring some nonsense into our country. And if you do, I'm going to deal with your ass and you're not going to like it. You're not going to like that outcome. So this game, I'm not sure what to expect. I don't know if we just, you know, if, if all we do is check IDs and check, you know, people coming in, or do we actually patrol the border? I don't, I don't have a clue. There is only really one way to find out. And I guess the only way to find out is by jumping into the game and let's play. Let's play Contraband Police. And let's see what this is all about. Clearly, this is not a game that was, uh, I guess, made to look like an American police officer. That looks like a, a police guy. I don't know what the fuck that even says. But this is clearly not our Border Patrol, the United States Border Patrol, which is fine. I really do not give a shit. I just want to play this game because, to my knowledge, and folks... Folks, I could be wrong, but to my knowledge, this is this is like one of the first games like this. I don't recall any other games that I can remember, and I'm sure there's something out there that's kind of similar to this, but this seems like this is the very first game just like this, where you're a border patrol person, you're at the border, you're arresting folks, you're checking IDs, and, and you're you're doing a different type of police work than what we've ever ever done you know what i'm saying like we played police patrol simulator we play you know in gta we've done we, we've been the police but nothing like this so i'm excited i'm pumped and this game is available on steam if you guys like it go buy it uh this might be just like an early access version i'm not 145 percent sure but that's what i'm kind of thinking but maybe not i could be totally wrong all right so Contraband Police is a work of a fiction. The game is inspired by reality, but it, but any author unauthorized resemblance to the... Okay, I didn't get a chance to read all that. I hope you all did. So this takes place at the uh, Kukakukka border crossing. Whatever the fuck that says, I don't know. I think that it was like 1981 is when uh this game is supposed to take place. This, it's got to be like, what, Germany maybe? I don't fucking... Jesus, dear gotta be German oh we can move around okay yeah this is very very nice uh, vehicle here let me see if I can figure out yeah I'm not really sure where this game is based out of I get it doesn't matter uh, we can read the uh, captions if you really want to but I don't I'm enjoying this beautiful scenery uh, you better follow our orders or you end up like was it all poor guy he just wanted to make a little more money on the side so he was a dirty dirty cop we are not going to be dirty as much. Hopefully not. Hopefully not dirty at all. So, yeah, we're literally on the border. Okay, we are here. Now report to the commissioner. Good luck. Uh, oh, cool. I can open this up. What's in here? Nothing? Okay, nothing. Awesome. That was a waste of fucking time. Open the door. Hello, world. Hello, people. Oh, we got our first customer coming up to the border. Where is the commissioner? Hi there. I am new to the post. I don't know what to do. How the fuck do I get in? Motherfucker, let me in. Man. Here we go. Oh. Ah, comrade, we were expecting you. Welcome to our Karsta border, whatever. I do not like reading. It is not my friend. My name is Commissioner. Who the fuck is talking? Oh, this guy. Okay, first go into the office and pick up your duty folder. We can do that. He said duty. Totally said duty. All right, here's a duty. The flashlight. That's a duty flashlight. All right, now open the folder and check your handbook. So tab opens the folder. Uh, here's my passport. Looks like I am good to go. My name is... Uh, this field appears to be on every document. The values must be the same. 
look for spelling errors. We got we can check for spelling. Oh, this is not my passport. I think this is just a sample passport. So we need to verify that their names match the spelling uh, expiration date. This field appears on the passport. Enter permit and citizen ID. Compare it with the calendar and check if the documents are still valid. So we could have expired documents, which is pretty cool. Uh, okay, so this box is found on the passport on the entry card on a citizen card, which is what passport number. Okay, compare the driver's license face with the passport photo. They must be identical. Okay, so we got to be pretty observant. Might lack in that area. Hopefully not. Okay, the Arkaziniente, uh, whatever People's Republic, is a country famous for its rich mineral deposits in uh, metallurgical industry. <laughs> Most of the population lives in the fertile western areas and around the fucking something. At the head of the communist government is the Arkasis Workers' Party. Fucking shit, which has ruled continuously since the Great Peasants Revolution 1943. Okay, so this is our country flag. Again, I don't know if this is even a real place. I think it's based, probably based out of a real place, but I don't think this is necessarily a real place. Saskatchewan. What is Saskatchewan? Germany? This is, it just rings German to me. I don't know why. Okay, I'm not going to read it. I don't read, I don't really care. The, what? The animals, the bear? Okay, the flag has a bear on it. What is all this shit? This might be stuff I need later on. I'm not going to memorize all this shit. Okay, so vehicles. Let's just, fuck, there's a lot to that. That's cool. All right, so today, today's April 6th, <coughs> excuse me, jeez Louise, April 16th, 1981. Okay, let's uh, close that up. Can we just, like, grab some of this shit? No. Who's sweeping? What the fuck are you doing, Bob? He's back there creepily sweeping, like, right behind me. All right, great, let's get started. Pull the lever to invite the first driver for the border control. So I'm just going to jump right into this, huh? Like, just day one, I'm already operating. Where's the lever at? Bob, where's the fucking lever, dude? Oh, it's out here. All right, so pull the lever. All right, guys, let's get into this. Let's get in here, man. We're just going to jump right into this shit. Shit. Great, now I'm speaking German. Hi. Hello. Need to see your ID, please. Uh, in order to enter, the driver needs to have a valid document, sir. Uh, yeah, I need to see your ID. Yeah, you, you're you speaking like a sim. I don't know what the fuck you're saying. Now, how do I open it? Tab? Uh, okay, so this guy's Jagger or something. Born in 1956. Expiration is May 4th. What is so expires next month? Uh, Jagger, M-A-D-E-J. Okay, that all appears to be okay. What am I looking at? Yeah, that looks fine. I, I already discovered. The, what? Uh, comparing fields and documents reduces your perception level when you get tired. Compromise becomes slower. Okay, so we're good. So we, can we take a nap or what? Don't forget to mark the errors. I don't see any errors on this guy. Inspection report. In this report, you will flag any... Uh, just, uh, mark at least one error before you turn a driver away. I have to have at least one error? Or leave a clean report when you... Grant and oh, I was gonna say, I don't why why am I have to why do I have to find like at least one error? That just sounds dumb. Uh, to get the highest rating, you need to find all the existing problems over time. The report will expand with a new error box. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Okay, so let's go up to our report here, folks. So, the name, the surname, he's cool. Oh, shit, no, that's fine. What the fuck, bro? It looks fine. Uh, expiration date at some point, uh, passport number. Y2K5, Y2K5, ED7J, ED7J, seems legit, photo seems legit, he's good, what do I do now? How do I pass him? I did. Matt, okay. I gotcha, let me go here, it's a match, let me go here, let me go here, that's a match, and then... Everything's good. Let's uh let's uh get him going. He's he's fine. I don't have any issues with him. Okay, sir. Uh you are all set. Can I have your documents? Inspection is finished. That's all. Have a good day. Do I check his vehicle or what? I mean I guess, can I look in his vehicle? This is see? Yeah, hell yeah, man. We're doing a fucking Bro, we're doing a full on search. Shit. Sir, do you have anything uh, illegal in your vehicle that I need to be concerned about? Any bombs, grenades, any women? 
anything at all. Um, yeah, thank you. Thank you for stepping out. I mean, you got a clean vehicle. You just got an old-ass vehicle. Sir, we do this with everybody here. Relax. Nothing like for Motherfucker, I am doing a thorough job. Go fuck a chicken. Get out of my life. All right, you're good. Sir, you're all set. Have fun. Peace out, bro. I don't need that. I'm done with him. Okay, uh, you can have a seat. Let's see. Inspection finished. Approved. All right, sir. Welcome to the great country of whatever we're in. I will close this for you. And have a good... Oh, shit. I'll close your door, too. Hang on. Hang on, hang on bro. Shit, dog. You're going to be taking off and that motherfucking door be open. All right, sir. Have a good day. Thank you for coming to our lovely, lovely country. All right, bring on the next person. Let's see what you got in store for us. Well, we got a line. Oh, I guess we only have two cars. It's not too bad. Uh, great job. That was the right decision. Call next driver for control. How are you doing today, sir? Welcome to our border patrol. How are you today? Can I have your documents, please? Thank you. Okay, serve this driver and then the next few. Okay, I'm trying to, bro. Pull my shit up. All right, so. Ooh. Ah, hang on. That does not that does not look like him. Like unless Can I get down to his I can't see his hair. Yeah, he's got a full set of hair. This dude's bald, bro. That does not match at all. That matches. Uh passport number 50WM XN4J. That matches. But Okay, so Cannot match reason for work, but we cannot, we cannot match this guy to our, um, to this guy. So it's different, sir. Yeah, I need you to get the fuck out of the car in a second once I figure out what I'm doing. F flashlight. Uh, can I just like check his car real quick, sir? I'm gonna search your car because you're not. Get the fuck the inches in the back? You're not matching up, buddy. I'm not sure what you got going on. Hi, what's up? Yeah, you're definitely not. Oh, wait, maybe it is. Let me see your face real quick. Maybe. Okay, well, we do have a we do have an issue with this, like, with this information, but I guess. Yeah, maybe the face, but he doesn't have a beard. So either way, we still have an expired expired. Uh, license here so and date of birth is not correct so we are definitely definitely not gonna pass this guy uh i am finished and you are denied entry my friend because your shit doesn't match get the fuck out of my country i mean come on dude well it's not difficult what is this up here what is that? Can I take that? Ooh. Contraband ex or collaboration exposed. So where's he go? He just turns around. Is that it? Like this dude is not legit. We just let him go. We cut him loose with his fucking trunk open too. <laughs> what a douchebag. Oh my God. Driver did not meet the requirements to enter the country. $80. $80. All right, let's bring it. Dude, I, you know what folks? There's a new sheriff in town. He don't fuck around with me. I know what's up, all right? You want to come in my country, you will obey my authority. That sounded so dumb. I will never, ever do that again, folks. I am so sorry. It sounded so weird. How yeah, hi. How's it going? I need to see your documents, please, sir. Thank you very much. It's like, give me the documents. Give me the documents. All right. We have this guy. Definitely don't know how to say his name. Uh, name matches. So we're good there. EW6L4946. That matches. Date of birth, July 7th, 19. Jeez, Louise, that does not match. These people are really trying to get in my country like that? Especially being a tourism, man. Come on. So what I want to do is kind of look around in his vehicle. Maybe we might find some narcotics laying around. We have yet to find any drugs. You know what's going to happen soon. It has to. Sir, do you have any narcotics in your vehicle? No? Okay. Well, you are not going to go through my country because you do not have the... Your shit does not match. And that is no good for anybody in life. 
You are denied. Okay, we need to get an arrest, oh, folks. What a day. Well, you know what? Check your shit. Everyone who gets denied gets... Oh, your trunk closed. Fuck that. I was going to say, everybody who gets denied, the trunk stays open, but his fucking closed. Bye now. Bye, Felicia. What? How is he clear his date of birth did not match? What the fuck? His date of birth didn't match. You are a dick. I do not agree with that at all. Sorry, but if your date of birth doesn't match, I don't know how you're allowed to come into our country. So let's talk about this game. I mean, the graphics aren't bad. The concept is exactly what the game sounds like. You're Border Patrol. <laughs> That's it. Hi there. We're going to try to really, really look at you because the last guy had a had a bad date of birth, but evidently we were still allowed to let him in for some fucked up reason. All right. So this guy name matches or does not B A N. Oh, okay. That's B E N. So that doesn't match. This does not match. Whoops. This does not match at all and this does not so am i not allowed to deny this guy or or what so date of birth oh that's fuck I'm, my bad folks god damn it that's not a, that's not the date of birth that's the valid that's 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 when it's valid so shit that last guy was legit totally my bad totally my bad what do we gotta match this to right here Shit, that sucks. Um, either way, we got we got a couple mismatches here, so he's not he's not good to go. We we're, we're, we're gonna go check his car out because I I've, I'm smelling something. I'm smelling something. Everybody's car is so freaking clean. Clearly, this is not real. <laughs> Nobody's car is this clean. I'm sorry. Unless you just bought your car off the lot. It is not going to be this clean. All right, sir, you are not allowed to come into our country because you did not pass anything in life. You are literally denied. You're making a mistake. Come on back. Come on back, bro. Bring it. What do you got? What do you got? That's what I thought. Drive away. I swear, if he's, if he's cleared, I'm going to quit the game. I'm not even kidding. There's no way in hell he's going to be cleared. Okay. There we go. Perfect inspection. That's what I thought. The last one was the last one was totally my fault. Now you can go to your apartment. I have an apartment. Where's <laughs> what the fuck? That's my apartment. Wow. That's a fancy apartment. Let me tell you what. I am so thrilled to I even have like new underwear. Like this is is my flashlight on? It totally is. No, it's not. I don't know. I have new underwear, man. I am living the life. Look at everybody can see me sleep, even though I don't really have a bed. So let's go into our apartment here, folks, and uh, take a nap with our fucking fish bowl of a camper because everybody can see us. So let's rest. Uh, sleep regenerates the level of your perception required for automatic document comparison. Fully full. Re uh, Regeneration takes eight hours. Okay, let's do eight hours. I'm good with that. We can update our quarters. We can like make this fucking apartment into an actual apartment. That'd be kind of cool. So that was my fault. Property maintenance. What is that? How did I lose money? What is property maintenance? Because my shitty ass camper? You judging me? Yo, I was always taught don't ever don't ever judge a book by its cover. That ain't cool. So let's check out day two. Hopefully we get some narcotics this time, guys, because we didn't get shit for drugs last time, and I want to get some drugs. Am I the only one that lives on the property? What? Uh, hello, command comrade. My name is General Dutta. I am the deputy commissioner, and I will lead you to your second day. We have recently observed the increased activity of smugglers from the gang. Yes, what I'm talking about. Fortunately, our intelligence service is already doing this, and will provide... You would necessary information on a regular basis. First, let's look at the information board. Okay. Let's go to information board. Bro, you're still standing here? Where's your bed at? Or where's your camper at? I'm the only one. Is that yours? Do you have an actual house? Huh. Hi. So you get a house, and then I get this fucking piece of shit camper. Man. All right. 
Uh, let's go check out the information board and see what that's all about. Uh, each memo is about a specific smuggler. So, smuggler number one, we suspect that a driver who did not stop for inspection yesterday would try to cross the border. Play number 77, Union Edward. Uh, okay, smuggler number two, one of our informants inside the gang has obtain valuable information regarding another shipment of contraband drivers age 44 so we're looking for a plate number where that starts with a 77 and a 44 year old male that's gonna be fun get i can't i'm stuck go there we go now we're now we're cooking all right let's let this guy through 77 and a 44 year old male that's what we're looking for folks because we had a uh, evidently when i was sleeping in my apartment over there, we had a runner. Somebody ran through the border. Hello, sir. Nice purple car. Need to see your documentation, please. Uh, please step out of the vehicle. Can I have your documents? So I do have the option to have them be escorted out of their car or demand them to get out of their car. That is cool. All right. Let's check the name. N-A-Z-A-K-A-T. Tamer. 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 T-A-M-M-E-R. Uh, passport number 7 nor 64 992 yellow valid okay so let's compare the names real quick that's good passport number appears to be good he's good until june it's only april he's here to visit which i can't do anything about date of birth 1950 i'm not really sure how much how it's gonna i'm not sure i guess i can count what is it this game oh it's 1981 so i guess we have to count from 1950 to 1981 to see who's 44 all right, let's confirm this individual's ca uh, cargo. Oh, it looks like we have our sus a su suspect, suspect here. Make him leave the vehicle to search the cabin. This is our suspect? Uh, sir, I need you to step out of the vehicle, please. You definitely like the color purple. Like, you 100% like the color purple. All right, smugglers mark contraband hiding. Jesus, however, it is only visible under UV light. Luckily, your work flashlight has such a function. So let's check the vehicle with our UV light. And we found a sign on one of the armchairs. So this is going to be his, probably his gang sign, I'm assuming, right here. It's the S. Okay. So now we're going to need tools to get the contraband out. Pick up the knife from the table. What knife? What table? Oh. Hang on. Let me go this way. Hey, don't mind me. I'm just cutting through. Oh, yeah. Snago, snago. All right. Let's grab the knife. We should... Jesus, dude. You can carry it a little bit nicer, but... I guess that works. You know, this should have been in our, like, do on our duty belt already, but whatever. All right. Oh, my God. What am I doing? I just... Jesus. Get him. Cocaine, gimme, gimme, gimme. Uh, contraband is not always labeled. Sometimes it can be hidden between parts or in a hard to reach place. Now what do I do? Uh, let's check under the hood here. Carefully in sight will come in Caref Here, carefully, eyesight will come in handy. More than a flashlight. Yeah, don't mind me. I just have my knife here. I'm not really sure how to put my knife away. And we have drugs. Great. Remember that smugglers can be very. Uh, for sample inspection materials, see your duty handbook. You, said duty. you can arrest that bastard now, sir. You're going to be placed under arrest for a ton of cocaine, bro. Like, don't be, don't, don't, like I said, there's a new, a new sheriff in town. Okay, don't fuck with me. Uh, criminals who are awaiting transport to the labor camp are held here. Upgrade the prison to increase the maximum number. That is cool how we can upgrade things. Oh, we already gave him a fucking prison outfit. That is awesome. Yeah, I'm going to close the door on you, buddy. Tell your friends I'm in town. Boom. Super freaking awesome. So I like how we can upgrade our, our jail. We can upgrade our camper. And this fucking dude is sweeping again. Where is he? Where is Bob at? Is that all you do is sweep? Seriously? Alright, this is your warehouse. You will store, intercept the contraband tools, weapons, and other things here. So we, this is our <laughs> this is our warehouse. Okay, maybe one day you can afford to improve it. Yeah, well that's cool. At least we have like 
a way to improve things. So what do I, do I put narcotics in here or what? Uh, supply checklist. This is where you can store your tools, weapons, recover contraband, the goods for trade. Upgrade your warehouse to be able to store more items. Items left loose will be lost. You can carry selected items from your inventory or directly from the police car. Move items quickly between windows. Okay, so let's uh, let's move our items over there. Uh, we'll keep our knife. Okay, so there it is, folks. There's our first uh, drug bust right here. Pretty exciting, man. Like this is awesome. This is this is cool. Like I'm gonna dig this game just because you can progress in it. You know, it's well. Shit, I want to close the door. We have nothing else to put in there, right? We can put our knife, but I'm gonna keep my knife. Because you can like upgrade and make things better and whatever else. Totally freaking awesome. All right, Bob, you still sweeping? This place is spick and span, dude. I could probably eat dinner off the floor. Uh, now go ask Officer Bob to get rid of the remaining vehicle. Hey, Bob, where you at? There you are. Hey, uh, what are you pissing? What are you doing over here, dude? Awkward as fuck, man. Hey, can you get rid of that vehicle, please? Mm -hmm. Need you to get rid of that vehicle. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? Really? They couldn't like put a tow truck in here. Yeah, go take your take your broom and go sweep some more. All right, there are different types of tools that are needed to open certain types of storage compartments. Then materials such as tire. Okay, fucking shit. You could, can also smash the hard elements with the use of hammers, axes, light, open crates, and car tanks. Okay, sweet. This is very very old school. What am I going over here? What is this? You want me to grab one of these? Okay, I'll grab them both. What else? You want, you want to smash something? How do I pull up? I? Let's take this out. How do I, uh... How do I equip it? Oh, my gosh. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm trying to, but I don't know how to equip it, bro. Give me that. Okay, so here we go. One. There we go. Am I oh, oh, am I supposed, I'm supposed to take that? Never mind. I thought he wanted me to smash it. All right, with this knowledge, you can return to further inspection. So, how do we put stuff away? That's my question. Just Oh, just hit the one. Okay, we're getting it, folks. We're getting it. All right, let's do this guy. Let's see if we can actually see some narcotics. Because that would be more ideal than just, like, tell don't tell us where it's at. I want to be able to find it for myself. You know what I'm saying? Howdy, uh, welcome to the border. I need to see your documentation, please. Jesus, fuck, bro. What is this guy doing? This does not sound good. What's this guy's plate number? That's not our other guy. Why is the music getting all weird? Why did he open his fucking door? Yeah, I don't like this. Give me your shit, dude. If you fuck around, I'll take an axe to your... Put an axe to your face. I ain't fucking around. I'm not even kidding. All right, name is wrong. That's already an obvious one. Uh, passport number is completely wrong. Valid is expired. We're here for work. This music is nuts. Hey, sir, I made you to uh, probably step out of the car. No, it is not. I need you to step out of the car. Your shit ain't legit, dude. Where the fuck you going? Stop walking. I can't handcuff him yet. All right, let's go search his vehicle real quick and see what he has going on. Let me get my uh, flashlight out. I'm not seeing anything back here. Why is the music so fucking creepy right now? Uh, let's check up front, I guess. Just be careful with the... Oh, it's the engine compartment. I would not want to sit in that chair. Alright, folks. I mean, honestly, he doesn't have anything that we should be concerned about. You know, like... Nothing. I don't know why the music is like... Am I missing something? Like... The music suggests that 
this guy's fucking up to no good. I don't want to kick him loose without really knowing that I didn't miss anything. I don't see anything down here. There's nothing there. Nothing on the tires. I don't, man, I don't fucking see anything. All right. I, I have nothing to keep this guy for. I mean, minus his documentation not adding up. I can't arrest him. So let's kick him loose. We're going to deny him because he does not match anything that's good in life. What should I not ask? Yeah. Get your shit together, dude. Let's see if we failed or what, because I don't want to fail. Have a good day. Get your shit together before you come back. Get it fixed. God damn. Oh, man. Something wasn't right. Oh, we got it. Perfect inspection. Can we save the game at all? I don't know how to save the game. Maybe something in here. Hey, you're still here, huh? Oh, cool. All right, folks. This is where we're going to call it a night. This was, uh, this is going to be fun. I think this is going to be one of those games that will probably keep you on your toes just because there's, there's something to look forward to, man. Like you can, do, so you sweep. You drink beer and you fucking sit here. You are worthless. Um, knowing that we can upgrade things is, is awesome. Like our, our apartment, we can upgrade our jail. We can upgrade like certain things. We'll get more, more tools for the trait. Like we'll probably, I don't know, maybe we'll get a gun at some point. Who knows? I know at one point and I don't want to, I don't want to say too much, but we might get a vehicle at some point. I don't know. I'm just speculating. It's all speculation, so we still need to find that guy when we come back. So, folks, I hope you guys enjoyed this game. And honestly, if you guys like this type of stuff, man, pick up this game on uh, the Steam website because it's totally worth it. And I'm going to be playing a lot of this game just to see how far we can get into this uh, this job at the border. Look at the oh, look at this shit. There's fucking tires up there to keep the roof on. This is some janky ass fucking border patrol, man. This country clearly has no money anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and i will see you next time